Question number 28. A has some coins. He gives half of the coins and two more to B. B gives half of the coins and two more to C. C gives half of the coins and two more to D. The number of coins D has now is the smallest two digit number. How many coins does A have in the beginning? A has some coins. Let us take number of coins with A initially. Number of coins with A initially equal to X. Then X gives half of the coins and two more to B. And B gives half of the coins and two more to C. C gives half of the coins and two more to D. Then how many coins does A have in the beginning? That is what we have to find. We have to find the value of X. Number of coins with A initially in the beginning. So A gives half of its coin, half of his coin and two more to B. Then B has X plus 4 by 2 coins. Then B gives half of what he has plus 2 more to C. Then C has X plus 4 divided by 4 plus 2 which is equal to X plus 12 divided by 4 coins. Then C gives half of what he has plus 2 to D. Now D has number of coins which is equal to the smallest two digit number. Smallest two digit number equal to 10. Then what is the value of X? What was the number of coins with A initially? In the beginning. So from here X plus 12 divided by 8 plus 2 equal to 10 x plus 12 divided by 8 equal to I'm taking this 2 here then 10 minus 2 equal to 8 then x plus 12 equal to 8 into 8 equal to 64 x equal to 64 minus 12 equal to 52 number of coins with a in the beginning equal to 52 Option D is the right answer.